Okay, today I'm gonna to show you how to make spooling your reel easy peasy. I mean, we're not gonna have tiny knots or put any tape or anything in there. I'm gonna show you a quick and easy way of how I do it. Now, when you get your new reel, like this Abu Garcia here, you look on the spool and you're thinking, man, what are these little holes in here for? Well, I'm gonna show you what I use them for. First, you take your line, run it through the eye until you get to one of the holes and then run it completely through to the other side. And then just tighten it up. And then I like to put my finger and thumb on the line, just like most of you, with a real tight winding spool. That way I know that it's going to spool up nice and even. And then there you go, a perfectly even wound spool right here on my, on my reel. Now, something else, don't put too much line on your reel. That's a big mistake by a lot of people. Leave about a sixteenth of an inch right here to the top of the spool, and that's plenty of line. You don't want to be fighting backlash all day. But anyway, man, that's as easy as I can do it right here. Easy peasy in spooling your reels the next time you want to do this. I'm Scott Turridge with the G3 Sportsman, and I hope this helps you the next time you want to spool your reels.